Hello everybody, this is John Bain. Wanna welcome you to Last Oasis. Hope you guys are doing pretty good today. I'm doing good myself. Don't wanna forget to mind you all to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you can be here when stuff happens, because here we go. Something brand spanking new, right in front of your face. Uh, I've actually been following this game uh, since I've heard about it uh, last year, early last year. I think it originally had a release date in September of last year, but then got pushed back until about now. So uh, we're going to check this thing out in case you guys aren't familiar with the game. Here's a little description about it. It's a nomadic survival MMO. You got to keep moving. The world is dying. Build walking mobile bases and travel to new lands. Create clans and fight for territory. Resources deplete fast, so take your sword and scavenge, pirate, and trade to stay alive. Uh, basically, it's a third-person PvP survival game. There's walker vehicles and machines and stuff like that that you know help you harvest and combat and work as a base. Um, this got many servers linked together. Uh, the world is generated procedurally. It's a player-driven economy, skill-based melee combat, a grappling hook-centric movement. Uh, nomadic world players uh, just keep on traveling and traveling. You don't really stay at one spot for long. And you can do solo or clan gameplay. So this looks pretty nifty glifty. Uh, been waiting to check this out. The machines look absolutely amazing. Um, and I've been uh, lucky enough to get a, a pre or early access code to check this thing out. So let's get early accessing and check this thing out. All right, here we are in the login screen. Uh, we have, okay, so here's where we choose our lady type or male type. Ooh. Okay, so we all have the same, I guess, oh, there's, there's other things here to change, so. And there's facial differences too. Hey, that guy has a very robust chin. I like that. That he has a chin too, but this one just seems more defined. I'm gonna go with the more defined chin. We are not one with hair, so let us remove hair. No facial check. Is there a five o'clock shadow? Ooh, uh, that doesn't look good. We're gonna go with this. Okay, hair color. There we go. Uh, I don't know. I don't care. I, it's like I'm looking at something that kind of looks like me, and none of them look like me. I like the chin though. I don't like giving go with default. All right, whatever. I don't really care. Blue eyes. That's what I've got. Uh, clothing color. Oh, interesting. That seems kind of me-ish. Body detail. Oh, we have scars and such. Okay. Oh, we can do with none. There we go. Wait, wait. Is there? Okay, there's head details too. Okay, there we go. That that's about as close to looking like me as we're gonna get. All right, create. Yes. Estimated wait time. what I have told you. If you find your trousers full of sand, you've landed in the wastes. Now shake it off and begin moving. Okay. The sun is near. It will consume this place. You have spent your entire life row, you row, have spent rowing your the flotilla. life rowing the flotilla. Oh. And now you have paid your debt. Huh? You will be taken to a pit in the wastes. Survive and return to me. I have more to tell you. Okay, this is movement. Okay, so optional. Uh, gather wood from the ground, grab fi fiber from bushes, and craft a beet stick. Oh, we're gonna make some fat beets, man! Okay, F is harvest in this game, okay. And we get XP for that. Okay, cool. I'm gonna grab a little bit more, because you guys know me. All right, we need some wood from the ground. Let's go find some wood from the ground. Is this wood from the ground? It is, okay. And do I have, where's my meters at? This one, okay, they're on the left. There's health, and is that stamina, or is that? That's interesting. I'm not sure what the bars mean over there, which is fine. So far, it visually, you know, fits the style of what we guys are used to. Is that a, it looks like it could be friendly. 
Ish. Grabbing all the wood. Screw this. Craft a beet stick. Oh, I can't wait to do some fat beets. So there's no reticle to kind of make sure you know where you're aiming at. It just highlights. What the heck is that? We're going over here. I want to craft a bunch of beet sticks because then I'm going to have some, lots of fat beets. Okay, we leveled up. Okay, so press C, crafting menu. All right, so I'm guessing it's some weapons. There's the, oh, it's a club. Hold the craft. Do I just press? Show the cactus when you cannot find water. The test is not so sweet. More like a bum rack. Did you call me a bum? You're a bum. All right, harvest cactus flesh from cacti. Get eat cactus flesh from the inventory. All right, so I'm guessing it's some more, or that's a very suggestive piece of wood. Um, what is this? Research progress and tutorial to collect the fragment. Whoa. Okay, it's running away from, oh, there's cactus right here. Okay, it totally is like, nice. It seems like it hits after a little bit, but that might just be a little latency, I don't know. How about first person? Okay, and what does right click do? Do we actually block in the direction we're kind of facing? Hmm. Interesting. So, um... Let's see up here. We have that and that. Eat cactus. Oh, we gotta eat. we gotta get a little more cactus flesh. Let's get that. Let's grab a little bit more since we're already started on this guy. That's like Planet of the Apes kind of crap going on over there. Or might maybe I don't know. Oh, there's stuff going on the bottom there too. Um. So let's do consume. Oh, so that bar in the middle. Is that the little globe is our is our actual hydration? You will find all the knowledge on your journey. Bring it with you. The sun has swallowed many treasures. Okay. Find a fragment in the walker debris. Optional. Use a fragment from the inventory to go into the tech tree. Unlock the sand bed in the construction tree. Okay. So let's go over to this area. Research. Okay, I got the fragment. Okay, is there research here? No more knowledge can be acquired here, so it's it's specific. Can I get in this thing? Oh, I can't. Kind of. Okay, the colliders are right on. I was wondering if they did a full collider or what. That the cactus is like, hey, gimme. And there is durability. Okay, that's good. Okay, so what do we have here? Um. It wants me to use the fragment. And then you go, oh, okay. Construction. And then learn the sand bed. A comfortable bed that's good for occasional respawn. Okay. Harvested from bushes, fiber is crafted in the fiber working station. Um, standing on sandy surfaces automatically provides a resource for crafting. Okay, let's hold that. That's what they wanted, we right? are surrounded by wastes. One side of the earth is hot and barren. The other side is dark and covered in ice. What is F3? Okay. Give me one second. I'm going to go through the key bindings right quick, and then I will let you guys know what the deal is. Okay, I thought there would be more to it, but there wasn't. Um, I did turn off the chat just because we're trying to do videos, so just in case some it's PvP in here, sometimes people get kind of heated. Just want to make sure everything's good. Make sure everything's good. Okay, so let's see here. Uh, we need to get some sand and some more fiber. I don't think I want to... Uh, oh, there's somebody here. I don't think I want to do anything just yet. Oh, they're going after them. Nice. We're going to move out of the way to give them a little bit of space. I'm not scared of PvP, but right now we're just trying to get the basics of the game together. And if they're trying to do the same thing, it's kind of rude, in my opinion. Let's give them a fighting chance, because, you know, zero death. Oh, God. Okay. 
Oh, that was pretty easy. And what is this? It's fiber, rupert pelt, a fragment again, and wood shaft. Okay. And we looted all. Now, do we have a limited amount? I think it's... Okay, we do have a weight, and we have space. All right, so that's how that goes. Let's go over here and grab some more fiber. And at least it's, oh, we, our health is kind of low. I wonder how we regain health. Probably with some sort of health regeneration thing. We need more fiber. There's a lot of fiber there. And I'm guessing that we, we should probably go ahead and use the rest of our water. Get back up to max. Okay, that was all of it. And we have two fragments now. Consumables, equipment, so interactables. What is it? Here's the primitive bandage. Unlock this technology from your tech tree. Press. Okay, so is it in vitamin? Oh, equipment. So we can hold, how many, do we have points somewhere? Two, is that the points there? I feel like that's gonna be important. It takes two fragments. Well, there goes our fragments there. Oh boy, I hope I didn't just do something stupid. Let's do four of them. Oh, so, okay. And how much do we get back by doing this? Oh, that's a nice chunk. Okay. So that will make it easier to manage, you know, existing in general, because then I can go up and fight one of these guys again. Like that. Loot them. Okay, not all of them are going to have the fragments. I didn't think that would be a thing. Okay, cool. Um, And what do we have? Do we have a map? Okay, it's hexagons. Walker crash site, various loot. Okay, and this is me. All right, let's go that way. I'm going to head over that way. You guys hold on. Okay, we're just now moving towards the center of this. Uh, the environment looks pretty good. Um... If I had to compare it to the visuals of one game, I would say close to Conan visuals. Um, the animations look really good too. And my quest thing kind of went away. Oh, there's F1 for keybinds? Oh, F1 to close that out, okay. What is P? Oh, we have points to spin. Gotcha. Um, let's put one health point here. Let's do one in this one. Um, we'll go and do this too. Let's kind of go uh, kind of a roundabout right now. And where we are, where are we in relation to, okay, this is where we are. Okay, so we're going to go down into these lower areas. Now, um, kind of wish we still had the, the tutorial thing going on. Oh, there's a building mode. Oh, oh. The wilds are overrun with savages called Rupu. They watch you from the brush. Now... Is there anything that can... Okay, so there is a bed like that can be broke. It can be broken pretty easily at that. Okay, and now we need to drag mouse upwards and hold. Right attack, drag. Okay, left attack. Okay, so there is that. I got another fragment from that. are envious creatures, and their minds swim with toxins, making them cruel. <laughs> the pant legs are getting to me. Okay, so we do the blocks like that, so we were doing it all right before, okay. And right block. It's like this. Okay. Rupu once surrounded me on the Black Hills. They danced and ate the flesh of my companions, guzzling their psychedelic brew. Okay. That's that's very friendly. I have to say friendliness there. I gotta kill Rupus. Where's Rupus? Are you Rupus? Is that a name or is that... I don't even remember this. Oh, yeah, yeah. These were the Rupus. So we got to kill these guys. 
I'm ready for a fight, even though I've already fought you. Okay, we gotta be careful. Okay, so we have to do it like that. Okay. Okay, so that's how it works, okay? A mysterious energy flows through the soil. Okay, we did that. We'll heal it one more time. Plants spill over the sand where nothing is meant to grow. Oh, uh, so we had to wait for that I light bar to fill up. Immense trees shoot up after a single rainfall. Okay. Come here. Come here. We got stuff for you. Got him. I was trying to beat his swings. Not just... Ooh, is that... Is that... What's the difference? Nothing. Okay, cool. Now, are we full or something? No, we're not. So we do have a backup of that. Our weight is still okay. Um, I do want to craft another couple ones of these. There we go. And then heal. So I wonder if we... I didn't pay attention. If we get hit... Um, while we're getting our regen on if it stops the regen or if it just like takes off the current health and brings down the potential by that much health too that would be pretty interesting to know all right so we need to unlock a campfire so we press o it says the campfire and that takes two we have five of those okay so we're, we'll be good to go so we can now do the campfire okay build a campfire so you press b craftables and then we click on it and then it goes there let's put one right here even though it's out in the open okay burn wood in a campfire so we have input we have the queue and that is where the wood goes can I hold shift or anything shift splits it does control control brings one Put cactus flesh in campfire, okay. Oh, and this is how we make water here, okay. How much can we make? Or is it just queue it up? It doesn't necessarily mean we can make it. What is that, a byproduct? Ash, okay. Interesting. So, uh, okay, so it takes certain more than than I th oh wait we can't we need to can we consume it we need a container and since I'm full on water I can't do it again let's see if we can make a container right quick um equipment it takes two of these Okay, so let's do that. Let's go to equipment. Let's choose. We need some fiber. Okay, that's not a problem. That's not a problem. We got plenty of fiber around here, right? We have plenty of fiber around here, right? I want to get over there. I want to check out that stuff, too. I guess we'll need the grappling hook to get up there. Get all this fiber here. He runs a little bit weird. and I think the, the pants don't help either. Okay, and that's right there. So let's go ahead and craft you. And then maybe we can fill the makeshift bottle. So how do we fill it? Slot protected on death. Up. Oh, so won't let me... Okay, that's not how we do it. So how about when we go on you... Do we put the container in here? No. That's how we equip it. Huh. Oh, we just moved the container. Okay, so left alt and that to the container. Okay. So now we've got water hanging out here. Okay, so these are all slots protected on... Oh! Okay, so these are things that we can't drop, and these are things we can drop. Okay. Okay, so can I... Is there a way to bring up a contextual menu to break it? 
Okay, whatever. Let's see. Can I consume you? Wait, consume is right click. I just drank the whole thing. Okay, I did that wrong. <laughs> Let me get some more cactus. We'll be right back. Okay, while running around, I found this. Is this something we can get? Loot. Oh, with three fragments. Holy crap. There's a guy running around. It looks like it's a, a mob or something. Uh, do I have my cooking pot on the map? It does, There it is right there. It's just a campfire. Interesting. So I got some more cactus. We just got some more fragments. Um, fragments are locked, so we don't have to spend them immediately with worries about loss. Let's cook. Um, let's put you in here. Let's put another piece of... Can I just do the control thing? I can. And let's consume. There we go. In the wastes, water can be more precious than worm seed. A stranded merchant traded me all his possessions for a bottle. Oh, I dropped it earlier. The flotilla is our last walking city. The center of the nomadic world. For those who do not ride the walker, it is the only refuge. It's our last walking city, so a nomadic world. Okay. Unlock a woodcutter's hatchet. Okay, so let's go to here. Is it construction equipment? Woodcutter's hatchet right here. Okay, damage 39. That's actually better than that. Okay, that's been unlocked. Let's go to equipment, or is it uh, tools? Tools. No, it's a grappling hook. Weapons? Okay, and we need some stones. I thought I had some stones. Oh, maybe I use that for the, the fire or something. And we get one stone per stone, so I need to go around and scavenge up some more stones. Let me go get some stones. Okay, I've got stones, so we should be able to cut this, no, make this no problem. Okay, there's that. Now, can we put you on two? We can. So, those are our two equipped items. Okay. And then we'll use a hatchet now on trees and uh, cactuses to finish the quest out. Okay. Let's try that out. Wow. Okay, that's way more efficient, obviously. All right, that got that. Now let's head up the trees. I know I'm kind of just running aimlessly, but I was trying to make it to the center, as you guys know. But then they got the quest back up, and now we're doing the quest. And the trees down. If you return to the flotilla, you must ride the walker. It is written in the scrolls. Which scrolls are they? Like the scrolls? Like what's the name? Or is it just called the scrolls? Or is there something else? Unlock Firefly Walker in the Walker Tech Tree. Okay. Uh, oh, we got to press O. And where would it be? In construction? No. Here's Vision Powder. That's repaired. Okay. I don't see anything. Oh, they're right there. The <laughs> Firefly Walker. Hold to unlock. Okay. There we go. So, what do we need to craft one of those? Build a. F oh, is it under the beam one here? Walkers. And so we need to craft it. Oh, I really like this. So, we need some more fiber and stone. There's some fiber here, and there's some stone over there. So we're going to have to build the walker the leg, and the leg separately, looks like. Will that get at least the body done? Let's try that. We need wood. Let me grab the mats. I'll be right back. Okay, we got the stuff. Let's click on it. And I got more stuff, okay? Oh, wow, there is a lot that goes into this, huh? Interesting. So this will take a minute to build, won't it? Yeah. Um, I wonder if I can make, learn. So I, I got another fragment. 
So can I do the pickaxe? Because that would make stone a heck of a lot easier. That's knowledge stuff, equipment, construction. It's an equipment, right? I think I have to be level 10 for that. We're almost there, too. Forging pouch. Uh, uh, designed to store a lot of fiber and organic materials, including sediments like sand. Okay. So, and I don't know what my XP to next level is. Uh, what is it? Oh, no, that's an O. What gives us the character stat screen? Is it P? There it is. So, let's increase our health again. Wait, what? What's, what's Walker's crafting? Used by nomads to trade with each other at trading stations located in most oases. Oh, so we can buy these. Oh, so these are how we get the different walkers. There's actually a decent amount of them right now. I wonder if there's a lot of rock, paper, scissors kind of thing going on. I guess I could use a little bit of stamina. Uh, let's pick that up and then health again and damage. This way I can at least be putting out a decent amount of damage here. Um... So that's pretty cool, and it seems like the flow of time, even though it's a year for a day, I kind of feels like it changed a little bit, a little bit. I don't know, maybe it's just me, you know, the, like playing these games so used to it changing. It just feels like the shadows have gotten a tad bit longer and stuff like that. Um, so to get this done, this is gonna take a minute. So let me take a minute to get this thing built because it looks like we're gonna need a few things. I wonder how much the legs are gonna be and stuff like that. Well, I guess we'll find out as we do it. I'm just gonna gather as much as I can and I like doing that. So let me go do that and we will return. Okay, welcome back. Uh, I actually had some people run by on walkers. I was hiding, hiding in a bush uh, like this. Wait, I had, I, had, I, had a, I had a move I was doing, but I just stood in here and didn't move at all and I prayed I should have done this. It's actually pretty amazing coverage. So don't click, don't get all the bushes. Save some bushes around what you're doing to protect yourself to a degree. So let's continue this. Okay. Oh, uh, there we go. Oh, we go to each part to craft it. Okay. Okay. All right. So now we have the legs to do. Oh, oh. <gasps> Our Terai built the walkers because there can be no rest. Keep only what you need. Abandon everything that cannot be carried. Nice. Pack a campfire. It's a campfire on your walker. Oh, wow. Is there another way to scroll out the view or anything like that? Um, I don't know. F. Oh, you can scroll it. Oh, open storage. Gotcha. Okay, so we can actually... Can we pack structures? Is that... Alright, I don't need to pack it yet, so... All right, so we can open storage. So how do, do we just build one in it? Oh, we can. I have received visions too. I have seen nations settle on the floor of the earth. And when I looked up, the moon was whole. Okay. So, craft the cargo hold inside your walker. Water storage. So, oops, let me do that. And we need, we can't respawn on this thing yet. So, can we do a, um, oh, how do we do this? We do B for build. Interactables. Can we put this on here? Can't place on this platform. Okay. All right. So, there is a limit to stuff like this. And, I, oh my God, is there a way to get rid of that too if I want to? This assembling mode. Okay, so there's this. I could have done that with the other cooking pot. Okay, that makes sense then. Let's go to our here. And let's see here. Can I do the. Um, is it equipment? Can I do a pickaxe yet? Oh, I unlocked more stuff since I hit level 10. Gathering pouches. Okay, 
it's that that's a new kind of that's a torch there's the simple repair hammer there's a simple sickle a simple pickaxe what does it take to learn it takes 10 fragments to learn this okay so that's how they do the the, the bottlenecking and gating between people okay that's that's fine that's fine I was just wondering um small chest water bag sandbag base okay hold on a second craft a, a cargo hold inside your so how do we do this cargo holds how do we uh, cargo upgrades here's the upgrades okay okay cargo hold tier one all right now we have a cargo hold getting crafted in there and then they want us to do a water storage water storage okay so there's the water storage and I assume it's gonna go right here all right so let's put this in here just to have it there we go oh I need 30 water in it. okay so since I have this I can actually kind of like drive it over to the freaking cactuses Wish we could do a different angle view of it, honestly. There we go. And let's go ahead and gather up and then like there we go. And then we can make us some water. That's actually pretty cool. I like that. So far it seems pretty cool. And I've been fighting anything that wants to fight NPC-wise, just to get more XP and mats and stuff. And just running in seems like kind of really work on these guys pretty well, honestly. I had a couple that blocked correctly and it was just over. So that's going to be really important on hand to hand is like making sure you know how to do your attacks. And that's a good way to practice too, I guess is just some... can we, can we, oh, you run, you run fast, don't you? Yeah, you do. Okay. So let's get back on you. Let's cook. Uh, we'll put this into here. We'll queue it up first. Holy crap. Okay, that was loud. Sorry. Sorry. Uh, let's take half of you and cook some water up. Now, can this work while I'm, while I'm, it can while I'm riding? Oh my God. It's like a beacon though. I feel like I'm a, that's awesome. It's got this bug kind of feel to it. The hell is that over there? That's interesting. Let's go over to this cactus because I probably need some and I'll probably have to grab some wood too. I really like how this feels. This actually has, it feels like how it looks like it should move, honestly. All right, we got a few there. Uh, can I go in, oops, I meant to go in you. Let's check out, oh, wrong thing again, open storage. All right, why is there no water in you? The water's in there now, right? Okay, there's still water in there. Let's pull out this water. Let's pull out this wood so I don't waste it. Oops. This water goes in here. Is there a way to put it directly into the... The um, actual bins in this or not? It doesn't look like it. So we have to manually move it over. Which is, I guess, fine since it's not that bad. God dang it, uh, other than me not being used to the interface yet. That goes in there, okay, great. Let me finish this up and we'll be right back. Okay, welcome back and there was the boo-boo. I didn't record what I did next, which was the next part of it. I finished the water, no problem. Got pretty good with that. Also, uh, end up having a quest to do the grappling hook. Which, uh, if you go over here in equipment, uh, where's it as uh, tools, so uh, equipment, so armors, armors, weapons, so tools, so right there, right there, repaired grappling hook, um, and that was is actually pretty cool. I was trying to find a spot to show you guys the how it works, um, but we've got it. It's actually a really cool machine, man. I really like how it looks. It has a cool feel to it, and when you hold shift, you actually are doing a boost. So since it's it's leg powered. And then I press it. 
don't press it so you actually get a boost on that so there's actually a reason you know for speed reasons too to to, to actually have people spec into stamina uh to ride the machines for like running down or escaping which i think is pretty cool um so I'm not sure what the max level is either, because that would really affect what that is. So let's see here. I just need to find something we can we can grapple onto. Watch, I'll run into somebody. This will be the great way. The best way to end an episode is, is zero deaths, right? I think it's not centered. It's gonna bother me. Um, nothing. And now when I came, when I logged off, you can do a safe log out. It takes a few seconds, like I think 120 seconds, to actually. Um, uh, to, to log out and it puts you in the lobby when you log out of the area that you're in because each server has its own hexagon pretty much uh, each 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 like a map is a hexagon its own server and you can switch between servers for different things and clans can claim like a hexagon or something like that too um and so there's 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 different things that different mechanics in there too for the long run of the game that people might be fighting over and or you know trying to hold on to or etc etc just trying to keep on moving. There we go. There's some cliffs. Now, how do you handle downhill? Like, it's a freaking... Ooh. Okay. Not like that. Okay. All right. So, we're over here. We'll try it on a tree or something like that. Just so I can show you guys what the deal is. So, let's get out of that while it's moving still. Because that's smart. So, I have a reticle now. And you can press your middle mouse button to shoot the, uh, the grappling hook. When you use the grappling hook, it eats up stamina as you do it. E reels you in. And you can actually force a swing out of it. And attack. So, and then Q lets you out. And then as you go with E, if you're near something you can grapple on, so you can actually climb on top of stuff. Let me get down. Let me get down. It's about to drop me. And the fall damage seems decently reasonable. Um, any further, and I bet you we would have fallen. And you can also do, like... Almost like a Spider-Man thing. So if you if you get your swing right, which I'm definitely not doing right now. Let's try that again. Let's get our stamina all the way back up and try this out. Oops, wrong button. Wrong button. Okay, now we're going to pull in. And if, if we get good at it, I think you could actually do the swinging. Like, like almost like, again, Spider-Man kind of S thing if you have the stamina. Which again, if you're a, um, if you're like a driver, that would be actually a good way to be able to get away and have great mobility. I don't know, I don't know how viable it is, but I just thought that was really neat. Oh, look at the moves! I got the moves, man. So yeah, that that is nifty. I don't know, you guys, let me know what you think about this. Uh, I'm sorry we didn't get through the whole steps of it. Oh, if you wanted to see, it was not in there. It was an O, and it was in crafting. And I, no, it was in equipment right here. There it is. There's a picture of it right there. Um, and I think it was right here. This is a repair grappling hook unlocked. Repair to grapple in a real swing and it, reel in and swing an essential tool for any nomad who wants to live long enough to see the next oasis. So that was pretty nifty. Uh, I think the ideas and concepts are there. And so far, it feels like it really hasn't been buggy at all. Like it's actually pretty clean so far. I'm sure there's going to be things to find. It is releasing into early access for it, but there is information for it down below if you're interested. Links and all that good stuff. But that is the time we got for today. Hopefully, guys, are liking what you see. If you're liking what you see, don't forget to slam the like button. It does help me a lot. Really do appreciate it. And as always, thank you so very much. And you all have a good night.